Okangudi Compliance School was fortunate late last year to receive $1.4 million donation from the former statesman, Hifike Punya Pohamba and his wife. The money was given for the construction of two hostels for 100 boys and girls who walk long distances to and from school and are camping under trees in the school vicinity. Upon receiving the donation, Arts and Culture Minister Katrina Hansa Himarwa did not waste time but hit the ground running into appoint a contractor to start the construction. Hansa Himarwa visited the school to assess progress made on the project. What you are seeing here is one of um, good stories to tell how fast we can do our constructions and complete our projects if we are dedicated, if we are committed. I am very impressed with the A to Z company who is responsible for this work. Immaculate work, professional finishing off, very beautiful work. Hansa Himara said it was her first time to be at peace with a contractor as all the contractors on her ministry's projects failed to deliver to her expectations. In the Ministry of Education, Arts and Culture, what I have found there, the larger part of the contractors who had job under Ministry of Education were not impressing. I'm not impressed at all with the type of work that the larger group of contractors has, has given the Ministry of Education, Arts and Culture. Because there is no time that people will be spending on one project for years while the people are waiting to receive the services that we, we have to deliver. So I'm sorry if people think that with uh, Katrina, they have got the right, let them climb on my back, I will run them off. The construction involves two blocks to accommodate 50 boys and 50 girls and ablution facilities for both boys and girls. The ministry has volunteered to construct a kitchen and a dining hall and also to erect a fence around the school. Okangudi village is the birthplace of former President Pohamba. The school was established in 1982 with five learners and has grown, today having more than 700 learners from pre-primary to grade 10. Pandurene Nepembe, NBC News, Hangwana region.